Action 7 News. A gun buyback event bringing out hundreds in Albuquerque to give back their guns. New Mexico State Police and others speaking with reporter Julian Paras about the impact they believe this will have in the long run. Five rifles, two pistols. Can you pop the trunk for me, please? At Expo New Mexico, hundreds coming out to give back their guns they have no need for. Those waiting in line say they can see the good it can do. Well, I think this event is good to help clean up some of the weapons we have. We have too many weapons out here in the public. Harold Robertson speaking on the amount of guns in Albuquerque and believes it is a growing concern. New Mexico State Police hosting its first gun buyback event of the year and offering a little something for people participating Saturday. So for handguns, they're receiving a $100 gift card. For rifles and shotguns, it's a $200 gift card. By 9 a.m. in Albuquerque, 114 different guns had been turned in. Guns also being collected in Las Cruces, Farmington, and Española. New Mexico State Police reports at least five guns that were turned in being listed as stolen. NMSP saying it's all part of one simple mission. Reduce you know, violent crime, uh, accidental deaths. Uh, suicides. Republican State Representative Stephanie Lord says although the gun buyback is a nice gesture, she says more needs to be done to find solutions to gun related incidents in the state. The elected legislation majority has a tendency to want to be softer on crime. We keep having a revolving door of criminals going in and out. Robertson says he supports more events like this happening to tackle violence in Albuquerque. This is an event that needs to be happening more often. We just have too many guns out here. Reduce the crime and reduce the weapons that we have circulating. A total of 750 gift cards were given out to people in Albuquerque, with nearly 2,400 being given out statewide. In Albuquerque, Julian Paras, KOT Action 7 News.